Welcome to the Like 97.1. How are you? Thank you so much. Muchas gracias. I'm so great. I'm happy. Uh, thank God. It's a, it's a good day and I'm excited to talk to you. First, I want to congratulate you for your song with Mesia, 500 veces. It's incredible. How do you feel about this song? Thank you so much. Oh, I, I love this song. I'm so happy that it is my first single in Spanglish, you know, Spanish and English. And I'm able to proudly show who I am, show my roots, my heritage with Messia, another talent who's amazing and such a great person. I love him. And together we collaborated to make this record. And I love this song because it's fun and flirty, but it also just has such a an awesome vibe to it. And the, the music kind of just takes you over. And I love the melodies. I love everything about it, so I'm very proud of it, and I am so happy that so far people love it, so thank you. <laughs> uh, it's a super sexy song, right? Yes. yes. <laughs> in in Argentina, when a song is sexy, we say it is for bebotear. It's like a uh, dance sexy with your cell phone. <laughs> yeah, exactly like this, like... <laughs> yes, yes, it's super, it's very good. Uh, we must feel sexy, the woman. Exactly. I'm so happy that my song can make you feel that way. That's amazing. Yeah. Uh, did you add and Messia meet? How did you and Messia meet? So Messia and I actually did a collaboration um, two years ago with uh, this song called Bamano, which was all in Spanish. And we had met through a mutual friend. And I uh, basically, long story short, my manager heard his music, showed it to me. We both loved it. We reached out and he was able to collaborate. And then we became friends since doing Bamano. And I thought he'd be perfect again for uh, 500 veces. So it's cool because he's my real friend, you know, so that always helps and makes a collab that much more better. The video is amazing too. How was the experience <laughs> of shooting the video? Uh, I see the video and I think, oh, I would love a uh, no to LA. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> you have to come. Have you been to LA before? No, never. Ah, you have to come. And when you come, call me and I'll take you around. Please, I love, I love that. <laughs> Yes. Um, what was the question again? I'm sorry. No problem. Question? How was how was the experience of shooting the video? Oh yes. <laughs> oh, that was amazing. Especially during you know months in quarantine in the house to be able to get out again and do what I love, being on set, creating a music video, being creative with the people that I love was such a blessing, especially during these times. Um, you know, I was so excited and we went out there, we came together and it was a day that was filled with so much happiness and peace and everything went so smooth. It was probably the smoothest video I've ever shot. And it was amazing to be back on set. Uh, so it was really a gift during this whole pandemic. Yeah, the video looks beautiful, it's amazing, Thank and you. congratulations for that. In October, you present your book, your book, your first book, Finding Your Harmony. In this book, uh, you talk about your story, not only as an artist, but as a person too. Which word um, would you use to define your personal journey at this moment? Oh, wow. I would define my journey as mm, de like a, I would say like the rainbow after the rain. Um, oh. Because for years I have, I have pursued a dream and it hasn't always been easy. I've had so many obstacles in my, in my path that I've never talked about. And in this book I share 
And but look where I'm at now. I'm able to live out my dreams. I'm able to to sing to millions of people, to change people's lives by doing what I love. It is the greatest gift, really, and I attribute that to to God, to my faith. And I cannot wait for people to read my story. There's so much in there. I I share my heart, you know. I share the good and the bad, but the uh, the rainbow at the end of everything. And I hope that in my book, I can inspire people to dream big, to go after their dreams, to not give up, and to most importantly have have faith. Yes, I love. I love. You are amazing. Really. Oh, thank you. You are, girl. <laughs> Back to music, the fans and myself. Uh, we want more songs. Uh, is there a day for yes. a next song, an album, maybe? Ooh. Well, I'm working on my album right now, and I know everybody keeps asking. And thank you to my fans <laughs> for being so patient with me. I want to make sure it's perfect. And there are plans being made right now. Um, I can't say much, but an album will come soon. I don't know when, but will come soon. But yes, there is so much more music on the way. And I'm going to surprise my fans. I have some dates in mind, uh, but I love to keep them on their toes and to surprise them. But I will say there's many songs coming out in the next. Like, okay. Okay. I love that. Yeah. Uh, last year, you were in our country, in Argentina. What, I know! What did uh, you like the most? Oh, my gosh. Well, the fans, of course, are unbelievable. The food. <laughs> yeah, the food, too. Oh, my gosh. The food is spectacular. Oh, my gosh. Dulce, dulce de leche, oh. the steak. Oh, my gosh. The empanadas. Oh, I, I miss it so Asa, much. I asado. About it. Yes. Oh my gosh. That, I mean, the whole city is gorgeous. The architecture, architecture. Wait, yeah, I said that right. <laughs> um, and there's so much to love about it. But I remember when I landed last year, I was greeted by so many fans and they came to my hotel and outside of my label, There's so much love in Argentina and it's beautiful. And I want to say thank you to all my fans out there. You are so awesome and beautiful and I I cherish you and I can't wait to hopefully be back soon. We, yes, we love you so much and we know you love Dulce de Leche and mm -hmm. when you come to the radio, uh, will we give you on? <laughs> yes, amazing. Oh, I cannot wait for that day. <laughs> Y'all have the best dulce de leche ever. <laughs> you you eat more uh, peanut butter, peanut butter. Oh, peanut butter? Oh, you mean in the States? See, sí. yes. Yes, yes. I, you know what's funny? I don't really eat it as much. I like more um, chocolate. Mmm, chocolate. Chocolate is my favorite. But dulce de leche is just, ooh. Crazy good. Thank you so much, Ali, for, for your time. Uh, we really admire your music and we celebrate that there are more and more women in this industry uh, showing all oh. their power and teaching their voice to the world is very important. And thank you. Thank you for that. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you very much. I love you guys, and I hope to see you soon. Stay safe, and God bless you all. Mwah! Besos. We are waiting for you in Argentina when this is over. Yes. Oh, my God. I cannot wait. I will jump on a plane as soon as I can. <laughs> Let me tell you, this is it was my first interview in English. I was so nervous. <laughs> oh, oh, my gosh. You killed that. You, you were flawless. I, really? I think you speak fluent English. That was oh, awesome. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so nervous. <laughs> oh my gosh, girl, you were perfect. Perfect. <laughs> you get a round of applause, girl. <laughs> wow. Thank you. Thank you very yeah. much for your time and take care and see you soon. Thank you so much, you too. Bye. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you. <laughs>